everybody. Welcome back to another Mixed Drink Monday. As you can tell, we're in a little bit different setting today, and that's because we are going to be making hot toddies. So we actually call this the perfect hot toddy. Many of you are familiar with hot toddies as a homeopathic remedy for the common cold. A very basic hot toddy is usually just water, lemon, and booze, primarily whiskey. Um, so we're going to jazz this up a notch because we really feel like hot toddies can be so much more and they're really great for when it's cold outside and maybe you're sitting around a fire outside or if you're just wanting to feel cozy. This is a fun drink and will definitely keep you warm all through the fall and even in the, into the winter. So as we've called it, um, we're doing the perfect hot toddy today and we are in the uh, catering kitchen here in Donawall just in case you're wondering where we are. And so we're going to get started. You'll just need a medium-sized saucepan, and we'll start out with eight ounces of whiskey. So in hot toddies, yes, you use whiskey, you can use bourbon. We are actually going to do, uh, use the Pennington Vanilla Rye Whiskey um, from Nashville, Tennessee. The vanilla is just going to kind of give this much more um, textured, layered flavor, and just really bring a nice warmth to the drink. So we're going to turn on our cooktop on medium low. Because really you're not going to boil this. If you boil this, the alcohol will start to cook off, which is fine I guess if you want that, but the purpose of a hot toddy is to have a little bit of alcohol in there. So we have our eight ounces of Pennington Vanilla Rye Whiskey. Already made a mess. And then you're going to put in six tablespoons of honey. So obviously in the hot toddy, if you're using it for a homeopathic remedy, it is to soothe your throat. So. Mainly what you're going to do is you're going to be heating this enough to dissolve the honey. Get all that in there, all that yummy goodness. Maybe. Okay, so six tablespoons of honey. And then you're going to take four cups of apple cider. So they were going to tie in, in the fall theme a little bit. We'll make sure this is not the best we can here. This will make your home really smell like the holidays as well. Two, three, that already smells good. And four. So we're gonna let that heat. It usually takes just about two minutes or so. Again, the longer you heat it up, the more alcohol is going to cook off of it. And while that's heating up, so we're going to add four cinnamon sticks to this. Just drop them in there. And we'll give it a good stir. As you're stirring this, you will really smell the booze. Um, but like we said, that'll cook off a little bit. The smell, I think, is just kind of strong. And now we wait for about two minutes. So our perfect hot toddy, the first parts of it, have been on the stove for about two minutes on medium-low heat. Again, you just have to get this warm. You don't really want to boil it. Um, just warm enough to your liking. Now, if you're going for a hot toddy, obviously you want it to be hot, have some steam, especially for medicinal purposes or even just cozy purposes. So we're going to take it off the heat. And as I said, we're going to jazz this up a little bit, right? So we've jazzed it up a little bit with the apple cider. Now you're going to take four Earl Grey tea bags. And we're going to place these in here and we're just going to let this steep for about two minutes but while it's steeping we're also going to add some lemon so you're going to juice about half a lemon into here and again you're just going to let that sit for about two more minutes okay we're back so our earl gray hot tea bags we're allowed to steep in the liquid for about two minutes and then as you remember we squeezed in half of a lemon so the juice of half a lemon and we just kind of gave it a stir and we ladled it out into our mug for our hot toddy and it's nice and warm and then you can just garnish with a lemon wedge and a cinnamon stick and you are good to go and you will be feeling better in no time or super cozy in no time so enjoy the perfect